what I would say is you definitely need to track that 100%. Like when you have services that you know, like, hey, you've just saved this customer from ransomware. That's where EDR reporting comes in. You want to definitely 100%. And I guess what I'm talking about right now is more service delivery as opposed to QBR type. It's one of those things where, yes, you need to highlight in a monthly, uh, well, maybe even daily, you know, when, when you've saved the customer from a catastrophic, catastrophic failure, you come up looking like the hero. So when you do that, or the frequency could be whenever it happens, weekly, monthly, quarterly, whatever you want to do, but you definitely need to communicate that value because, you know, having something like an EDR and MDR solution that is now blocked certain things from happening could, could have prevented ransomware and a catastrophic failure across the entire organization. Having backup, right? When you've restored a server successfully, that is a live disaster recovery test. That should be also a talk track with the customer around how awesome you are as an MSP because you just saved their bacon. Yeah, and I've done QBRs with customers and it's one of those things where, you know, I look at, example, I'll look at things like the number of tickets they've generated over the month versus what they spend. There are, there are a lot of other metrics, by the way. I'm talking this particular number five, when I say operational efficiency, is really just a highlight around some service delivery stuff. I've got tons more benchmarks around other areas of MSP life.